Hello, Marvel fans. This is JR369. <clears throat> Sorry, this is JR369. Well, today I'm going to take a look at the Pop Spider Man Homecoming number 227 GameStop exclusive Glow in the Dark The Vulture by, of course, Funko. <laughs> Look at the packaging, just a standard pop packaging, you know, and on the back, just the same. So let's release the Vulture out of the package. And I'm per it is basically the, exactly the same Vulture pop, but the only main difference is, is basically, he glows in the dark. I mean, I did got this at the um, Boom Loot, like, you know, the Swap Buy Pop, Swap Pop. It's like a Swap Me, but... You know, you know the, you know what I mean. You know, if you buy, like you go take a pops with you, you trade them or sell them, whatever. But I did got this from a seller at the Boom Loot, Loot, and I and this seller is selling it for ten bucks. I mean, ten dollars. That's that's a. I'll take it. It was like, I don't. The pop is worth like about twenty one bucks. So, yeah. And I saw some sellers selling it for about, I have no idea, I better look on eBay to check how much this pop is selling for. So, here we got the Vulture out of the packaging. Now, look at the pop. Yes, it's basically the exactly the same pop. Just, like, you know, there's the outfit that he wears in the film. You can see the straps, like the buckles, you know, etc. There's the clothing fabric coat on his jacket right here. You can see the, um, I guess, in the straps for his wings or some. Uh, basically, these are the straps. I don't know, know what it, these are. Maybe they're a part of his jacket. Maybe you can see the claws on his feet right here. And it's weird that mine has this black cap on, black line on it. No idea why. Probably just a mistake by Funko. Or maybe the seller just... I don't know. I mean, the pop looks, here looks really good. The wings looks really great. The helmet looks really cool. I mean, it looks really great. I really do like that. I mean, I really wish Funko could make another version of the Vulture with the unmasked version of, of the head. That looks a lot like Michael Keaton. I'm pretty sure that make sure, I'm pretty sure if they will do that unless if they have the if if Funko has the rights for the Michael Keane's head, I mean, I mean it looks I would be awesome, probably because Mattel owns the um, DC figure lines, probably maybe, and also yeah I really wish like they could make a James Gordon pop from the Justice League movie and like Hasbro owns the um the rights of Marvel so I'm pretty sure if they could do like you know some sort of trade like let's say I'll trade you this the Michael Keane pop head for a a um JK Simmons body likeness mold or probably Funko should ask the um the actual Actors J.K. Simmons and I mean J.K. Simmons and um, uh, Michael Keenan to do the um, to, to add their likeness to the toys, like their heads for an alternate head that'll be even great or something like that. I don't know. So let me just turn off the lights for the glowing features. Now let's use the um. Nope, my bad. Now let's use this kind of light. I have no idea what it's called where, you know, the Ellie or something, I don't know. So yeah, it does glow really easily with this light. Now let's try the regular light. 
Now you can see this pop glows in the dark really well. I really do think this is a really awesome. Let me try this again. Do do do. Let me just let that the eyes here. The uh, wing parts or whatever on his hands. The feet, the wings right here. Try the regular light. Mm -hmm. mm, it looks really great. I really do like this a lot. So let me just turn off, turn on, turn back on the light. So yeah, overall I'd say this is a pretty cool pop. I really do like this pop a lot. I mean, it looks really cool. So that's about it. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to subscribe for new videos every day. And also turn on the notification, the bell icon after you subscribe in case there's new uploads. And of course, follow me on Instagram at JAR369. The link will be in the description down below. So yeah, have a good day and goodbye. <music>